everyone. Welcome to our channel, Rebecca Stu and the crew. I'm Rebecca and today we have a new video for you guys like we do every Friday to show you what's new at the Dollar Tree. And this will be for the week of April 8th, 2022. I went to five different stores in the Dallas area. So let's go shopping. We went to apparel and accessories first. I combined all the pictures from all five stores into this section here for the apparel. They had these boxes of necklaces and earrings, which I thought was really cool. They had coordinating earrings and they all have some version of the Lord's Prayer on it. There's lots of different styles of necklaces and earrings, and they come in gold and in silver. So some of them will have the whole Lord's Prayer written on it, and some of them just have a portion of it. And some of them, like the smaller things like the earrings, will actually just say the Lord's Prayer on it. But they all come with this really nice wrapped card with a decorative background that has the prayer on it as well. And as you can see, they do have the whole prayer on some of them that were large enough to fit. I thought it was really nice that they put these out. Of course, it's almost Easter, so I'm sure that's why they're gearing up with some of their more religious items. So they have their earrings and necklaces. Now, I didn't really think to look at the time. I know some people are sensitive to nickel. I don't know if these contain nickel or not. So you might want to check that out. But even at $1.25, hopefully they won't be too bad. I thought they would make a really nice gift for an older uh, teen, maybe for their Easter basket or just as, you know, a gift to wear for yourself. So there's lots of different versions, as you can see here. And just a few more. I wanted to slow the slides down a little bit. Someone had said they were a little bit too fast, so I hope you guys are getting a better view. And just remember, you can always pause the video if you need to check out something a little bit closer. They have some sandals out this week. They had a whole bunch of designs and styles. I love the cheetah print. And of course, they have them in children's sizes all the way up to adults. Now, if you don't care for the decorative patterns, they also have them in solid colors. And then for the real little ones, they have the shoes that have the strap that goes all the way around the back of the heel that is also adjustable. And this week, um, they had out a bunch of the Gildan brand um, polo shirts, which I thought was really nice. So they have them all the way up from 5X size down to about six months old. So depending on the size that you choose is what color it comes in. So it, it seems like they get a whole bunch of one size and one color, and then the next size down will be a different color. So unfortunately, you can't get them in all of the colors because the sizes are are specific to the color shirt that they got. But for $1.25, it's really not bad. They also had a bunch of their gaiters in, a bunch of different styles and designs. I know a lot of people aren't wearing masks anymore, but these are pretty versatile. I think they're good for hunting and just cold weather in general. They also had a bunch of their drawstring bags in this week and some new colors. They had a really light silver, which was really pretty. I've never seen that color before. They also had pink, this light purple, and a really pretty bright blue. Those all have the zipper on the front for the additional pocket. Then they had some new bandanas. These are 100% cotton. They have this really pretty uh, rainbow looking one. They had the camo, which is usually one that they carry from time to time. Also this one, which was the buffalo plaid, which I liked a lot. And then this blue one here with the peach uh, stripe with the flowers, which is really pretty. Over in the arts and crafts this week, there were some new items. I was excited to find this chicken wire. It actually says floral garden, but I found it over by the deco mesh and the ribbon. So they just had the one box. And as you can see, it was kind of tucked towards the back and they did not have it in the garden section. You get a 12 by 50 inch roll, which is pretty good for $1.25. I also found some more of the metal ribbon. It wasn't stocked yet. It was still on the uh, U-boat to be stocked. If you guys haven't seen them yet, they're still probably coming. They just haven't made it to the shelf quite yet. A bunch of deco mesh this week and some new colors for spring. And these are all the solid color rolls that have the shimmer stripe through them. They had some of the tubing to match all of the colors in the uh, deco mesh. So if you guys are looking for them, they were in a really close proximity to the deco mesh. Also, they have their springtime colors for the floral toll with the little white, kind of like paint flecks that are on them. Uh, really pretty pastel colors and you get three yards in each roll. Last week, I showed you guys they had these wood signs with the 3D rays like rainbow, welcome, hello, and home. I found these at two more stores this week, so three out of the five. So if you haven't seen them yet, keep your eye out for them. Hopefully they're coming. 
very soon. Over in the health and beauty this week, we'll start with cosmetics first. There wasn't a whole lot new there. There really hasn't been for quite a while, which surprises me, but I did find these makeup brush holders, which I thought was really neat in three different colors. They had them in the light blue, a bright pink, and a light purple with these rose cutouts. These are similar to the ones you'll see at Five Below, but they were just $1.25 at the Dollar Tree. They also had their sugar foot scrubs to match. And I showed you guys these about a week ago and they all kind of coordinate with the cosmetic bags that I showed you guys last week with the floral pattern on them. So this would make a really great kit to put together for like Mother's Day maybe in a gift basket. They also had some new um, gel nail polish this week in quite a few different colors. This is the new color brand and it says it just takes one coat and does not need a UV light to set. So they had a bright purple, they had a light gray, bright pink and two colors of blue. They had a little bit of a darker shade and then this lighter shade of blue here. And now for the hair care items, they had a bunch of new hair uh, accessories. They had a bunch of these scrunchies that have the bows on them attached with the tassels that hang down. Um, these were kind of like a satin material. Then they had these two scrunchies with the daisies on them. I love them so much. I think they're so cute. So they have the black one here with the daisy. And then it's kind of like a periwinkle color with the daisies on it. You can get a matching headband to coordinate with the scrunchies. So if you prefer headbands, you could always purchase those instead. They weren't right next to the scrunchies. They kind of just put them where they had room. So you might have to search for them a little bit. They also had these scrunchies that are like furry. They had them in the light pink and light blue. Or you could get these new clock clips in the matte color. They have it in dark, like a rose color pink, really light pink, also the dark blue or you can get the smaller clips, which coordinate with the larger clips. And there are four in this pack as well. And they had some new snap clips. This is, I believe, a 10 pack. And it matches a lot of the color scheme of the new hair items they had out this week. They had the Scunchy brand mini elastics. I think you get 40 in this pack. And so you would get like 10 of each color or you could get the all black. Now we'll move over into the pharmacy and personal care. They had these... Um, New loofahs that are like really frilly kind of looking. So they're really dense. Also some new um, deodorant, which is aluminum free by Dove. And they also had these new lavender scented warming eye masks. Also some of the charcoal toothbrushes, the, the eco-friendly ones. They just brought these back. Um, you get the two pack. You can get the charcoal um toothbrush like whitening powder it's been a while since i've seen that probably almost a year they also have the charcoal um, floss also some cherry blossom hand soap which is my favorite scent and now let's move over into the fun finds so in the fun finds they had these really cute boxes of these lunch game boxes for your kids lunches and there's a bunch of different cards of games you could play just as a fun little surprise in their lunch also they had a bunch of these uh, two packs of tie-dye scrunchies and some marquee lights. I love the cloud with the different color um, bulbs on the light. I thought that was really cute. I've never seen it with the different color um, bulbs on it. And they also had the unicorn. You do need batteries for those. They had some neoprene style uh, cosmetic bags in the bright colors. They had green, blue, purple, and pink. And each one has a really nice saying on it. And this I love the font that's on the front. I don't know if you guys do, but I think they're really nice. Then they had the more of like a plastic rubberized kind of feel cosmetic bags. And those were also up in the front on the little stand that says fun finds. So I just wanted to show you guys that they had those as well. They had this pen. It's kind of like a rainbow with a diamond at the top. And now we'll move over into home decor. This really caught my eye. They have these gorgeous pillar candles in the soft pastel colors for Easter. I've never seen them in these colors before. Usually they just have the really bright yellow, blue, and red, and white, which are usually the standard colors. So it was nice to see them in the soft pastels. They also had these decorative pillar candles in pink, white, blue, a soft taupe, kind of brown color, red, off-white, kind of like an almond, and 
just the plain white. They also had some votives. These were really neat. They look like a mercury glass on the inside, but they fade up to clear. And they also had them in black. It's a little bit harder to see the mercury glass on the black ones. Then I found these pink and silver votives. They're pink on the inside to show this little flower uh, pattern that's on them. I just thought these were gorgeous. They really caught my eye. They're so pretty and shiny. So if you guys see those, really check those out. Also, they had a bunch of these cactus glassware. So you can get, I think they're a candle holder to tell you to choose some of them with the smaller holes in them, like a pillar candle. They also had some for tea light candles. And then they had one that was just like a pitcher that you could fill. And that's this one here. And for the glassware, they also had some trinket trays that look like flowers. Also really great for Mother's Day. So they had this light pink. They had yellow. And then you could also get this white flower. And then they had two different style of leaves that were different colors of green. So this is the light green. And here is one in the dark green. Then they usually have those like farmhouse style pictures. This year they have them with these really pretty colors on them. I just thought they were gorgeous. Check out some of them though. They do have some paint drips. So make sure you check them out before you buy which one you know you want because you don't want one that's not painted well but i thought they were really pretty for a dollar 25 and then they had these glass birds also and they come in three different colors you can get them in this soft baby blue and then they had it in pastel pink and then of course they had the white Then there were a few new fairy garden homes they just put out. I thought these were so cute. I know these fly off the shelves. Everybody really seems to like them a lot. So they have the boot house here. There's a close up so you guys could see it a little bit closer. They also have this house with the flower at the top in pink. Here's a view of the back. This one is kind of supposed to be like a pine cone house. And here's a view of the back of it for you also. Then my favorite one was this one. It looks like a honeycomb, has bumblebees on it, and a purple flower at the top. It was so well painted and designed. It's absolutely gorgeous. Over in Housewares Home Maintenance Organization and Storage, they had these large baskets that have the faux kind of like wicker look to them. You get the extra large ones in the dark blue or light ballerina pink, or you can get the smaller baskets in the rectangular sizes in gray the rose color they have also um, this coral color and a soft kind of like sea foam green you can get them in the round style also you just really depend on what store you're at some of them have them just in the round some of them have the rectangle and some of them have all of it so i don't know uh, why each one has different but they do they also had a bunch of their um, hand towels and washcloths out for the bath they had three different colors of blue the coral color and gray and then some new stain uh, wizard it was by the corona brand and as you can see from the top here it's got this little bristle brush on top to help scrub out any stains and now we'll move over into the kitchen and pantry so this week they had this three pack of the snap closed lid containers and the pink light blue and dark blue so that's the bonus pack they had some new coffee mugs these are really tall square style coffee mugs in blue and black with the brown top and then my personal favorite find was the coasters that say make memories along the way with the blue truck and flowers they also had some new sparkling water which i thought was kind of neat i've never seen this at dollar tree before so they had the lemon flavor you could also get the pineapple mango and then this one here was the mixed berry this also was a new item I found this week was the taco sauce in a 16 ounce bottle. They had some new hot fries and the salsa picante um, flavor. Also these new um, frosted flakes and some new cookies. They had tofu this week, which I've never seen at the Dollar Tree. And then they brought back the drink mixes. So these are the no calorie drink mixes. They have mojito, strawberry, uh, margarita and they also have just the regular margarita i also found some pomegranate juice in these glass bottles which i thought was really neat over in the office home library and teaching tree section this week they had their flexible rollers in three different colors you could get them in purple black or blue there's a close-up of one of them for you guys 
And then they had some more of the label makers. I still haven't found the tapes. I guess they're not going to sell it. I'm really not sure if they're going to sell it or not. So far, no luck. And then they had a bunch of the color washable glue and the Elmer's brand and Crayola brand. A bunch of new posters for the classroom. These are 22 by 17 inch posters and they are really, really nicely made. I think for $1.25, you can't go wrong looking for some um, items to decorate your room. They have them for tiny little kid classrooms all the way up to high school version. So there's really lots of different ones to choose from. And you could also get some new journals this week. So they had a bunch of these um, paperback journals. The coloring and the pictures on the front are so pretty on the cover. A lot of them do have a Bible verse or the um, reference to a Bible verse on the front, I think also gearing towards Easter. Now we'll move over into the party supplies this week to see what's new over there. They had these new party cups. You get six in a pack for $1.25. You get four different colors. You could either get them with the polka dots or the stripes. The stripes and the polka dots are like a gold metallic. They're really pretty. Also, they had in a few of the trifle bowls in the different colors. So last, a few weeks ago, they had a bunch of the party supplies in the three different colors. I only found the trifle bowls this week. You could also get them in the clear. And then they had some Fiesta style decorations, which were new. So this was called La Fiesta. You get one piece. It's the honeycomb sombrero. They also had an avocado. And then you can get this garland. It's got like a pinata and a cactus on it. Also, this garland is just a bunch of decorative fans. They had their metallic looking um, table covers. I love the one with the polka dots. The pictures actually don't do it justice. It's really pretty. They also have the metallic like rainbow that matches the tablecloths. Or you can get these new fabric gift bags. You get three gift bags for $1.25 and they have kind of like that hollow iridescent kind of shimmer on them. You can get them in green. They also had blue. Here are the pink ones. And then they had them in purple. They had over by the wedding items, these gorgeous plates. You get 16 plates or 20 napkins. Showed you guys the napkins last week. So they just got the plates in this week. Over in pet care this week, not a whole lot new. They had some new color food scoops. Uh, there's four different colors of them. And then they brought back the um, tennis balls that are covered in the hard rubber. I actually got some of these to do a craft with. Hopefully I'll show those in a video um, in a week or so. And then they had in... Um, a couple of these new chew toys. These are called the Beef Bully Chew Dog Treat. And they have them in a bunch of like different sizes and shapes. It says it's 100% natural, grain free. Or you can get this new natural balance food. And they had it just as targeted nutrition. Over in the seasonal items this week, they had some of their spring items like the Lay's. They also had their um, signs for springtime with the little truck, the welcome signs with the flowers. And then they also had the little trucks in different colors for spring. The purple one says spring is here with the bees on it. Um, this blue one I think was my favorite. It says fresh flowers. And then this is like a dark pink, just says fresh flowers as well. And then the light pink one says spring is here. Last week I showed you guys they were putting these yard signs out. They had them out at a few more stores this week. And I wanted you guys to be able to see them a little bit more up close. I had just shown the sticker that was on the box as they were waiting to be stocked last week. They also had these large bunnies. I love these so much. They're about two feet tall. They're so cute. I absolutely fell in love with them. Then you can get your glass gnomes. These are adorable as well. And then the yard sign. This is like the aluminum that says hello spring with the bunny. I also love these farmhouse looking signs. These are so cute. I love that they're on trend and just a bunch of different Easter signs and table displays. They also had this Easter egg garland, which I fell in love with. As you can see, they're pretty big for $1.25. It's got the speckled Easter eggs. And they had some of the spring luau items or summer luau items. They have their straws with the honeycomb little decorations that open up on the straw. There were like flamingos, pineapples, and umbrellas. 
They also had some of their summer items like the um, beach balls in two different colors for the pool. And then they had the floating cup holders. You could get the seahorse, the flamingo. They had a palm tree. And then the unicorn. Also, they had some table decorations for Memorial Day. You can get the stars in silver, red, and blue. There's like two stars in there and you have to pop them together to stand. Also, they had their plates and napkins to coordinate. And some of their food containers. Then they had some more of their luau items like the signs. And also the garden items, they had this new um, soil. It's really neat. It tells you how much soil you get for each pot that you want to fill. They're these compressed um, little like bricks. And it says it expands up to 10 times just adding water. They had their peat pot seed starters in and the house plant fertilizer spikes. I also found the pour and feed singles by Miracle Grow. And then they had some of the torch fuel. I apologize. I meant to put these together. We have some more of the luau signs. They have like pineapples and in some inflatable items as well, like the watermelon and the large sunglasses that say fun in the sun. They also had their yard outdoor pinwheels with the stripes and a bunch of different colors and then the pastel polka dots. And now we'll move over into toys, games, and entertainment. So this week they had out these little tiny stuffed bears in a soft purple, pink, or brown. You also get the remote control keys that make noise when you push the buttons. They had them in red and in blue. Then I found these really fun watering cans that look like animals. They had a duck. And the water comes out of his mouth. You also get the elephant. The water obviously comes out of his nose and then the, the whale, and it would come out where his spout would be. I just thought those were so cute. They also had these little baskets with some sand toys inside. They come in three different colors, and then they had the three different color sand buckets that look like a castle. I just thought these were really neat. For $1.25, you can get them in yellow, blue, or pink. Then for summer, they also had the small basket of sand toys, or I'm sorry, like bag of sand toys. You get a bunch of different sea animals in them. They also had their uh, hula hoops in a bunch of different sizes. I think there's like three different sizes in the boxes. You can get the large bubble wands in a two pack and then the large um, extra big like bubble maker. They have one of those wands there as well. I also found these Lala Loopsy little outfits. Um, these came from another store, obviously. They were like an overrun. You get the pajamas, the hooded towel, or the sleep sack. They had their little baby doll bathtubs in the blue and pink with the different accessories that come inside, like the soap or the rubber ducky. And then they had a bunch of micro figures by Mattel. They had all of the Toy Story characters like Woody, Buzz, Forky, and Bo Peep. And then they had some of their Monsters, Inc. characters like Sully and Mike. Or you could also get the Transformers. Those are a keychain. They have like Optimus Prime, Bumblebee, Megatron, and Soundwave. Also, they had their Frozen characters on keychains. You could get um, Olaf, Anna, and Elsa. And then they also had their Muppet characters like Fozzie, Kermit, Miss Piggy. Gonzo and Summer. Then I found these tops that light up. Um, they have them in three different colors, red, blue, and green. Also the sponge bulbs that are metallic. These are the high bounce balls. They're really pretty colors actually. I took a picture of all the colors that you could get. So you guys could see those. And now we'll move over into the Dollar Tree Plus items. Now these are gonna be the three to $5 items. You can get this 20 pack of wash cloths for $5 and these soft pastel colors, kind of natural colors. Also, they have a bunch of their bath rugs in in different colors like purple, soft pink, 
They have a darker purple and a seafoam green. Some fleece throws for $5. They are all the buffalo plaid style. They had like a dark green, blue, red, and pink. Also the blue, I'm sorry, the black and gray. Then they had their mainstay throw blankets for $5. That's a Walmart item. And then for $5, they had these extra large throws or plush blankets. It's called a glitter throw. It's a 50 by 60 inch blanket. You can get them in two different colors, the gold and black or the silver and red. I also found these one yard fabric cuts by Create It, and they are $3 each. You get the rainbow stripes. This one has a bunch of different um, sayings on it, like be you, love, and peace. They also had it in pink and white. Or you can get the peace signs also for $3. And that is one yard of fabric. Or you can get the fabric squares and a bunch of different colors. So each pack has like five different colors in it, and those are $5 each. And there's two different packs of different colors. Then I found this roll of fabric scraps. And they were $5 also. It says you get 20 pieces. And they had these baby dolls. It says it's a much loved baby. They are $5 each. They come with like a little uh, shampoo bottle. They had some mini guitars. Those were also $5. So close ups, you guys could see them a little bit better. They're each styled a little bit differently. Their troll dolls were $5 each. Also, they had these little characters. They were $5. And they're like a sequence animal. Um, the box shows you what each character is. They're a little bit hard to tell. At least they were for me. I'm sure kids could tell them apart quite easily. This was a little elephant. I think this one was supposed to be a zebra. Here's a view of him from the back. And then the box. And they were just called shimmies. And they had the game Pictionary for $5. Also, this bubble steering wheel it comes with the bubbles. You do need batteries. Those were $5. Some Play-Doh sets. They have the dentist kit for 5 Also, the um, barber shop. And then the sweet treats. Like a yogurt shop. They had some extreme flexible uh, characters here from different movies like The Incredibles and Toy Story. Then they had this Americana palette flag. It's a 21 by 13 inch sign. So here's a view of it from the back. It has a hanger on it. And here is the front, just gorgeous for $5. They had some shoes. These are like a rubberized type sandal, kind of like a Birkenstock style. They had them in black and in white in a bunch of different sizes. Those will be $5 each. Or you can get the decorative sandal for $5 that has these really pretty rhinestone strap on the top. Then they had some new pallet wood boxes that you can DIY. The one with the X's down the side. And I thought this one was really pretty. I like the design that they have on the side of the box. They also have just your regular pallet box for five. Here's a view of the inside of it for you. They also had these large wood birdhouses that you could DIY. I love the one that looks like a little barn. Also, some more of the wood crates. Again, just $5. They also had some pre-mixed pouring paint in different colors like light pink, onyx, dark red, coral, amethyst, and lime green. The large floating chairs, those were $5 each also. Then this is like an electroluminescent wire you could put in your car. They also had coasters to put in the cup holders that light up and a whole bunch of car care items like tire foam, tire shine. They had upholstery cleaner, some lint-free towels to dry with. Those were $3. They also had some of the, um, like almost like a turtle wax. It was a wax and dry. Those were $5 also. So all the car items were between $3 and $5. These extra large planters that look like a foam metal and they have them in gold or silver. The cooler bags to put like pop cans in or picnic items. They had the plaid or you get them in solid colors. And then they had these extra large coolers for like the beach. And there were three different ones of those. 
Also, they had these um, sunset projecting lamps, which I know a lot of people like for five. Also, some pillows. I just love the striped one. I thought that was really pretty. This one was definitely my favorite, the one with the crochet look to it. One looks like a large dog. They also had some with sayings on them that love you to the moon and back. And these are really large throw pillows for $5 each. And that's it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. And here are some other videos from our channel you might also enjoy. And don't forget we post DIY videos every Thursday. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.